Welcome back everybody, Twitch367 here, and today we are kicking off episode number 11 of our Skyrim journey. Um, last episode was our 10th episode, which was an hour long. Um, I did say I was doing something special, and that's what I ended up doing. Um, for today's episode, we're going to take a break from working on our house, and we're going to go ahead and head back to Whiterun, and kind of mess around with the companion quest line a little bit um i will get back to the main quest within the next few episodes though so you guys don't have to worry about that um if you guys could tell the audio is a lot different if it's not where it's usually at i will have it fixed within the next couple of episodes because there's some tweaking i need to do with my new mic and yeah this is a really long cutscene. there we go so we're going to go ahead and wants me to buy lumber. Okay. So we want to come back to white run and we're going to speak with the leader of the companions. There we go. I say we will come back to the house and work on this eventually. That'll probably be episode 20 or so. Um, just because I want to kind of keep the house building to some of the longer episodes because then we can gather uh, any resources that we do need and we can also just kind of talk and build at the same time and not have to worry about doing too many quests. And I think we're going to just go this route. But I hope the audio quality is a lot better for you guys. Um, when I was doing a couple of the different tests before the recording, it sounded pretty good. But there's still a little bit of tweaking I want to do. And let's kill it. That one. There we go. And say, today's episode, just gonna kind of work our way towards white run again speak to the leader of the companions um, and just kind of get that kicked off I know I'm on the opposite side but we're gonna have to cross the bridge anyway once we get through Riverwood so I figured this side of the river would be fine Oh, who are you? Hello there, fellow traveler. Hello. Say so this is a lot different. I've been playing a lot of uh, Elder Scrolls Online lately with one of my friends on Xbox. So, so if you guys have not already added me there. Uh, my username will be in the description along with all the other social media so you can go ahead and follow me there I did make a post about the new mic too so you guys should uh, go follow me and this way you guys can see what is going on and future uh, I guess episodes and uh, future series too because um, I have a few things planned um, I do also plan on having a few, like, kind of pulls for you guys to kind of help me out with, because there's just some things I'm unsure about. But now we have the continue down this road until we get to white run Hey, if you guys have been keeping up with my Minecraft series, 
um, we are going to be building that community center building that I have talked about for the couple episodes at least um, so that will be built in the next episode like I have promised you guys and there's also going to be a modded series I'm not sure what mod pack yet but it will still be a minecraft mod pack obviously um, and hopefully that should be coming out the first Friday of September which will be the fourth and perfect so I, I plan on buying a horse eventually um, I'm not really sure how the horse mechanics work in Skyrim. I'm not too familiar with it. Just because I usually don't go that route. Now I have to go this route. Um, I also plan on if there's certain areas that are kind of far and I have a quest, instead of making that path, just kind of going that way. Um, I do plan on just hiring a carriage driver to bring me there. It'll save some time. It'll make the episode just kind of more full of the main quest rather than just me walking and talking. I think we're making pretty good time too. I say, uh, thought the journey all the way to White Run was actually going to take a lot longer. So let's go ahead and go in here. I say I love the companion quest line. I know you can become a werewolf through this quest line. And ooh, let's watch this fight. Lydia, you're in the way. Thank you. You're pathetic. I'll see you. Come on, somebody just win already. There we go. Yeah, hit him while he's down. I haven't seen you before, have I? Have we met? I've got a map. Take a look at it. Now we can go ahead and head down here. So that I can go talk to the leader. I've been tending to the warriors at your Vasco for as long as I can remember. But I still hear the call of the a stranger party. comes to our hall. I would like to join the companions. Would you now? Here, let me have a look at you. Mm. Yes, perhaps. A certain strength of spirit. You're not truly considering accepting him. I am nobody's master, Vilkas. And last I checked, we had some empty beds in your Vasco for those with a fire burning in their hearts. Apologies. Thought perhaps this isn't the time. I've never even heard of this outsider. Sometimes the famous come to us. Sometimes men and women come to us to seek their fame. It makes no difference. I'm what Brutus. Matters and their arm. Of course. How are you in battle, boy? I can handle myself. That may be so. This is Vilkas. He will test your arm. 
Vilkus, take him out to the yard and see what he can do. Aye. All right, now I get to go follow him to the yard and show him what I'm capable of. They're not very fast. I'll go ahead and wait for him to kind of exit I've had it bug out a couple times where uh, I've left before he was able to and I just didn't want to work after that Just make it. But for now, you're still a whelp to us, new blood. So you do what we tell you. Here's my sword. Go take it up to Yorland to have it sharpened. And be careful. It's probably worth more than you are. Oh, I highly doubt that. Have you met Brutus? He's a pretty cool guy. What brings you here? I'm guessing you're the newcomer then. Uh, does he always send newcomers to on errands? Oh, don't worry too much about it. They were all whelps once. They just might not like to talk about it. And don't always just do what you're told. Nobody rules anybody in the companions. Uh, someone has to be in charge though. Well, I'm not sure how they've managed it, but they have. No leader since Yzgrimor. Kodlak is the harbinger, and he's a sort of advisor for the whole group. But every man is his own, every woman her own. Are you a companion? Not actually a companion myself, but none of them know how to work a forge properly, and I'm honored to serve them. My name is Eorlin Greymane. I work the Skyforge, best steel in all of Skyrim, all of Tamriel. All right, I need to be going. I have a favor to ask. What is it? I've been working on a shield for Aella. My wife is in mourning, and I need to get back to her soon. I'd be much obliged if you could take this to Aella for me. Didn't you just tell me not to be a servant? I'm still gonna put. I'm happy to lend a hand, though. But this isn't a command. Oh. Just decency. I don't know why it did that. I've got to get back to my work. Okay, whatever. I don't like how it does that sometimes on PC. But we can go ahead and bring her the shield. Wherever she may be. Oh yeah, she's in that one room. Oh, I'm just a servant here. Tending to the warriors of your Vasco for as long as I can remember. All these younglings scampering around. Worried one of them is going to take your place? Some of them might try, but that's not what I'm worried about. What then? That they might get themselves killed. By you? They should be so lucky. All right. If you Isgrimor himself wouldn't have the patience to deal with all the rabble around here. I have your shield. Ah, good. I've been waiting for this. Good to see you made it up here. You know this one? I saw him training in the yard with Vilkis. Ah, yes. I heard you gave him quite the thrashing. Don't let Vilkis catch you saying that. Do you think you could handle Vilkis in a real fight? Uh, I don't care for boasting. A man of action. Here, let's have Farkas show you where you'll be resting your head. Farkas. Did you call me? 
Of course we did, Ice Brain. Show this new blood where the rest of the wealth sleep. New blood? Oh, I remember you. Come on, follow me. Well. Skior and Ayala like to tease me, but they're good people. They challenge us to be our best. Nice to have a new face around. It gets boring here sometimes. I hope we keep you. This can be a rough life. The quarters are up here. Just pick a bed and fall in it when you're tired. Delma will keep the place clean. She always has. All right, so here you are. Looks like the others are eager to meet you. Come to me or Ayala if you're looking for work. Once you've made a bit of a name for yourself, Skior and Vilkas might have things for you to do. Good luck. Welcome to the Companions. By the way, if you're looking for something to do, we've gotten a letter about someone needing some muscle right here at Whiterun Hold. I don't know what the fight is about, and that's not our business anyway. I just need you to go out there, look tough, and scare this milk drinker into submission. No more than that. I don't want to hear about a killing, understand? I think I can do that. Get to it then. By the way, if you're looking for something to do. All right. The latest recruit, right? Wait, is that right? Are you always drinking? Might head down to the meadery later. See what you're brewing up. I guess so. so. Uh, that answered my question right there. I don't owe you money, do I? Well, you might. What do we got here? I'll take it. Skior says that I have the strength of Isgrimor, and my brother has his. I'll take the Horker Tusk too, just because when you're building your house, I'm pretty sure you need a few of those. Um, just for the mounts. We can't afford it. It took me. You tried mercenary work? What well, were you two arguing about? My sapphire doesn't like that I've been spending so much time looking for my father's old sword. He fed his entire family with the gold he made using that weapon. I'm not about to let it gather dust in some thief's trophy room. Do you need help finding the sword? I tracked it to a group of bandits nearby, but I'm no fool. I'd need the white run guards or maybe hire the companions to get it. I don't know why I'm, I'm saying companion. this, but if you find it out in your travels, I'd be grateful to you. All right. If you so find that sword, to starve your wife and daughter to reclaim some rusty old sword, I just need to hire one, maybe two men. Good men. I can't scare me into submission. Let's go. Come on. Let's see who <laughs> remains. <laughs> did it mean to so actually what we're gonna do we're gonna load this right here let's try this again I you can't scare me into submission let's go all right come on let's, let's try to stay away from the guy You know what you have to do. Please leave me alone. 
I suppose. Alright, now let's re-equip my weapon. I got a few things in here still. Alright, now I can return to the companions, turn in the quest, and then we can kind of just kind of go from there. So, let's go ahead and head back over here. Go back inside. Oh, he's right here too. Some people don't think I'm smart. Those people get my fist. But you, I like. Well, thank you. I took care of our problem in uh, White Run. I figured you had it in you. Nicely done. That's a hundred gold. I'm looking for work. Skior was looking for you earlier. What does he want? Don't know. He just said he needed to talk to you before you do anything else. I don't like making him angry. But there is some work for you if you want it. All right, I'll go ahead and go talk to him then. There you are. You wanted to see me? I did. Your time, it seems, has come. What do you mean? Are you trying to kill me off or something? Last week, a scholar came to us. He said he knew where we could find another fragment of Wolfrath. He seemed a fool to me, but if he's right. The honor of the companions demand that we seek it out. Uh, I would be honored to retrieve it. There's a fine line between respect and bootlicking, new blood. Whatever, dude. Like your spirit. We've decided this will be your trial. Do well, and you'll be counted among the companions. Varkas will be your shield sibling on this venture as well. He'll answer any questions you have. Try not to disappoint. Or to get him killed. All right, now I gotta go talk to him, and he went outside. There he is. I hope you've read it yourself. You're going to be my shield brother. So I'm told. Let's see if you impress. All right. Until next time. To follow me? Yes. Perfect. Say so Lydia will go back up to the castle. Um I don't remember if she has anything of mine, but I'll make sure I check that again later on. Now we can continue on. Let's see where it is we have to go. Yeah, over this way. That's what I thought. My favorite thing about doing these uh, different quests is I'm actually opening them up on my map, like just the different locations. And I just like how full the map gets eventually. Because if you look at our map right now, it's pretty empty, especially up north. Um, but like if you come down like into here, it's getting pretty full pretty full over in this area but there's still a lot of places that I need to visit um, to get those on my map I think for this episode we will make our way um, to the area we need to be and then we'll probably call it there and then in the next episode what we'll do is go ahead and finish up the dungeon place that we have to go in with Vargas so let's go ahead and head on over here.
say, I know there's a, quite a few different places out here that I haven't quite yet discovered. Maybe I'll have to do that one for one of the future episodes. It's just kind of explore a little bit on the map and just get some different locations in there. We can go ahead and get this real quick. It's kind of neat. I'm backing off, don't worry. I would hate for one of you guys to come after me. Because I don't think I could handle that just yet. Maybe once I got some better gear. Maybe in the future. Who knows. So I know if you follow the foxes instead of killing them. They're supposed to lead you some, to some treasure. Um, I don't know if they always do or if it's just kind of like a chance something uh one of you guys will have to tell me that in the comments down below mud crabs i'll let them be this time perfect right up here is the area we need to go to works for me perfect and what I'll actually do is come down here because I know there's some skeletons I can kill and I only got a few minutes left so I can kind of pass a little bit of time just killing them like that so I don't want too much of it just took that ooh that's pretty good and then I know that's enchanted and we'll go ahead and kill that guy too get five gold on them I don't really know what the one helmet that I just picked up I don't really know what they looked like usually I go for the uh, horned ones so I'm just gonna oh okay I like the horned better okay let's kind of see if we can pick this lock There we go. Found the area. So that's half the battle. If I could get it. Come on. I was very close. I think I'm going a little bit too far with it. Not far enough. Let's go about here. Perfect. Alright, now I just leveled up, so let's go ahead and do that real quick. And we'll go ahead and put it into stamina. Uh, we will save the perk point for the next episode. This way I have time to decide what I want to put it into. And we'll go back up there real quick. And then we'll end the episode up there. Alright, so this is where we're going to end today's episode. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, be sure to like, subscribe, and comment on the video if you have not already. Um, be sure to remember that um, every 10th episode is going to be a Q&A and just kind of a break from the main 
quest lines and even quest lines just in general. It's just going to be kind of working on the house and going from there. Um, and yeah, so go ahead and put any just suggestions for future videos in the comments. I will look forward to those. Um, I like to read through what you guys say. And with that, Brutus, we'll see you guys in the next episode. And I hope you guys have a great day. See you next time.